And Adelaide Oval will be packed again tomorrow night when superstar soccer club Liverpool takes on Adelaide United. The English giants arrived in grand style and are looking forward to putting on a show for their die-hard fans. The most successful club in English history touched down in Adelaide. Liverpool Football Club arrived in a private jet, the half a billion dollar cargo on show. About 50 loyal fans were at the airport to welcome the players who were ushered out a side exit. The captain and coach waved hello as they continued their world tour. It's good to get a few games under our belt. Um, obviously this morning we're done a recovery before we got on the plane and everyone feels OK so we look forward to the game on Monday. The English Reds excited to get on Adelaide Oval and tackled the local Reds in front of 50,000 fans. But we come out here, we expect always the tough games. You know, the game last night against Brisbane, technically very good. We understand and know that Adelaide will be the same. But they admit they've got some homework to do on their opposition. Probably do a little bit more on, on Adelaide um, in the next couple of days in, in training and stuff. Um, and that's, that's when we look, uh, look at them. United held its final training session before tomorrow night's exhibition hoping the spectacle will be a chance to recruit some more fans. It's a big game, eh? It's uh, maybe the biggest game that uh, never played here in, in Adelaide. Adelaide United, and we are excited and looking forward for tomorrow. But this trip is all about Liverpool and its supporters. How much of a die-hard fan, eh? Uh, pretty die-hard. I haven't got me arm done. <laughs> like, tattoo. We've been overwhelmed by the support that we received here two years ago and now back here already. Yeah, this time. And Port Adelaide may have found a new fan. Brendan Rogers sat in the Powers coaches box for showdown 39. Although the English footballers were left a little perplexed by Australian rules. I mean, a little bit bigger than us, a bit stronger than us, but yeah, like I see it's good to come along and, and watch something a little bit different. And Jack Paquetta joins us live from Rundle Mall. And Jack, what else are the stars getting up to before tomorrow night's match? Well, right now we've got Liverpool goalkeeper Simon Mignolet and young gun winger Divock Origi signing autographs for hundreds of fans who have come out here to Rundle Mall to meet the stars. But fans will also get an opportunity to see them strut their stuff a little later tonight when Liverpool take to Highmarsh Stadium 8 o'clock for their first training session in Adelaide. And fans will get an opportunity to meet the stars after training. They'll train for about an hour and a half and then they'll come along and sign some autographs and meet everyone at Highmarsh Stadium. So if you want to meet Liverpool players, that'll be your best opportunity before tomorrow night's game.